Sup, ladies and gentlemen, Akulanya, and welcome back to each and one of you. Of course, if you are new to the channel, thank you so much for joining us. I am very happy to have you here. In today's video, uh, we are actually looking, well, uh, we're still looking at a live reaction and viewing and discussion of the Winter Queen Ysera's spoiler cinematic, where we get some really, really uh, crisp and very, very juicy lore spoilers within that cinematic that we are discussing. I do, again, try to stay as awake as humanly possible after 15 hours. That's not always easy. But I hope that you'll enjoy it. I hope that you will have as much fun uh, watching it as I had making it and as chat had listening to me being completely broken. I I'm a broken man at this point. I can genuinely say that. I I'm, I'm so tired. But I'm going to see you guys tomorrow on Twitch. Hopefully, you'll join me. If you don't want to, that's fine. But if you do, the link is in the description down below. Remember to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and smash that bell. But most importantly, just enjoy the content. I make it so that you can enjoy it. Like, you're actually going to make me watch this. As tired as I am, as bonkers as I am, you're going to make me watch this. All right. All right. All right. I will. But you guys better love me, because if you don't, I'm never doing this again. My queen, please help us. This is of my sister. Why have you brought it to me? Um, um, uh, <clears throat> may I just, uh, may I just, I believe, uh, I believe there was a discussion at some point where, uh, we, we, we kind of talked about, uh, yeah, we, we kind of did talk about this, right? My queen, please help us. This is of my sister. Why have you brought it to me? This one is slipping away. Our duty is grim. Many have been lost. Why would I save her? Pet. Those who have dreamed by its side awaken with a joy and peace that whispers of wonder. If she dies, then all that is emerald dies with her. Some must be sacrificed, but some must be saved. If we forget that, all that will remain will be empty shells and sorrow. She's actually fucking killing herself. Alright, that was fucking huge, bro. 
the that was fucking huge. She no. Elun, why would I raise her pet? It's Elun. The sister that she's talking about is Elun. So this confirms that Elun is not a first one. But even more so, even more so, this, I would say 70% confirms my suspicions that these fuckers... These eternal ones do not belong in the Shadowlands. These, this is not their realm. They are not from here. They, they call themselves eternal ones and they call the Zuval a, a brother because they are all titans. They would probably refer to the titans from the, uh, from the order plane as brothers as well. Right? Because they're all titans. They're all sort of the same. But they are not from the Shadowlands. I believe that the, the Zuval is a god of death. He is an actual god of death. They are not. And there's actual evidence for that. Or at least partial evidence for that. But here's the problem. When they brought Ysera's egg. Listen closely to what she says. To all, everyone that's saying it's A&R. It might be Freya. To everyone that is saying this. Listen closely to what she says here. My queen, please help us. This is of my sister. This is of my sister. Who brought Ysera into Ardenweald? Think carefully. It was Elune that brought Ysera in. Ardenweald, by the way, houses a shit ton of things that she does not want there. The Loa? The Loa sleep in Ardenweald. This is where they are born. The Winter Queen fucking hates the Loa. She can't stand them. She doesn't want them involved with Ardenweald. She doesn't want Ardenweald involved with their problems. The Loa should stay, stay out of her way. But unfortunately... The Winter Queen doesn't have a say in that. The Arbiter decides these things. So the Winter Queen has to take whatever is given to her. This is of my sister. My sister brought this in. Why the hell are you bothering me with it? If you want this thing saved so much, go to my sister. Go talk to Elune and let Elune save this. Because it's not my job to save this. But you also get quite... A bit of hostility between these two. Why have you brought it to me? This one is slipping away. Our duty is grim. Many have been lost. Also, the way she says, why have you brought it to me? Right? Suggests that... And maybe I'm just too fucking tired... To, to year of the difference here, but it suggests that they may have had another option, right? Why have you brought it to me? Suggests that you could have taken it to her. W w why are you bringing it to me, right? To me, it suggests that there may be another option. You didn't have to bring it to me. They couldn't take it to A&R. If A&R was her sister, there's no way they're taking it to A&R. ANR is not one of the Shadowland Eternal Ones. ANR cannot come into the Shadowlands. ANR has nothing to do with the Shadowlands. So trying to bring that the, the Ysera to ANR, and also ANR had nothing to do with uh, with Ysera actually ending up in Autumnweald. So I don't know how that would have any bearing whatsoever on anything. No, this is one hundred percent about Elune. One hundred percent about Elune. Now, let's just quickly, let's just quickly talk about why I believe now more than ever that the Eternal Ones, this, uh, this, uh, bitch, and I, I don't, like, when I say bitch, I just truly mean that I don't trust them. This is not me, like, necessarily saying that they're evil. I genuinely do not trust any of the Eternal Ones because I believe they have, from the beginning, they have 
presented themselves falsely. From the very beginning, they have been false. Right at the beginning of the Shadowlands, when you get to the Arbiter, you get a cinematic where they show you what Shadowlands, what the Shadowlands looked like. In that cinematic, they say, the Shadowlands um, had order. And Ouroboros held it together or something like that. And Ouroboros was the, was the anchor that held it all together. Um, I'm trying to think of the exact quote. Can anyone in chat remember what the exact quote there was? The Shadowlands was ordered. Worked in perfect order. Gilly, thank you so much. Really fucking appreciate that. The Shadowlands worked in perfect order. The way they phrased that immediately made me think, what, what are you talking about? Steve Denuser tells us very specifically in an interview, time is a construct of order. Time has no bearing in the Shadowlands because they have nothing to do with order. And yet, if you look at their systems, their practices, what do you see? Think about this. If you really pay attention to it, do you not see a world, a realm, that may have been very much like our own, invaded by order, and order sort of imposed on it? Think of what, what, the, what the, the Titans did to Azeroth. Think of what they did on Azeroth. They imprisoned everything that sort of threw order out of its place. They established order on top of everything else, right? They layered order, so to speak, on top of it. Why does the Shadowlands feel the same? Why do I get the same feeling when I look at the Shadowlands? This place where order was sort of forced into it. I don't, I don't understand this. So my speculation theory right now is that Zuval is a different type of Eternal One, a different type of Titan than what they are. He is the Lord of Death. He is a Lord of Death. They are not. And if I am correct, if I am correct and Elun is the sister of the Winter Queen, then that fucking confirms it. Then that confirms it. Why would the Winter Queen's sister not then also be a Death Pantheon? Can someone explain this to me? How can how can the Winter Queen's sister not also be a Death uh, a, a a Death Pantheon Eternal One? Emerald Assassin, I think so. I think he, he predates them. At least within the Shadowlands, he predates them. But yeah, th I mean, this is mind-blowing stuff, by the way. The, this cinematic is absolutely insane. I, I love the Sylvanas one, but I fucking really like this one. I really enjoyed this one. Because, uh, yeah, we did have a theory that Elune is the sister of the Winter Queen and... So far, it absolutely suggests that that is what it is. And I'm sort of happy about that. I am sort of happy about that. 